Welcome to Listpedia. It's time to count down the top 10 foods you probably haven't tried. Number 10. Century Eggs You can be rightly mistaken in thinking century eggs are eggs that have been stored for 100 years. A delicacy coming out of China, century eggs can be made by preserving either duck, chicken, or quail eggs in a mixture of quicklime, ash, and salt before being wrapped in rice hulls. The process takes anywhere between weeks and months with the end product delivering a dark green or gray yolk with the white turning into a dark brown jelly substance. If you're interested in trying some century eggs, it is available in Chinese restaurants or Chinese convenience stores and are best eaten with pickled ginger. You can also find them under the names Thousand Year Eggs and Millennium Eggs. Number 9. Witchetty Grub The French have frogs, and the Australians, well, they have grubs, witchetty grubs, which are large, white, wood-eating moth larvae. It is still eaten today, but is more commonly known as a high-protein source for indigenous Australians. Their name refers to a few things. Witchetty, because the larvae eats its way into the wood of the witchetty bush, and grub, because it's both food and a larvae. They can be eaten raw or cooked, with their taste differing between nuts, scrambled eggs, and chicken. Number 8. Rocky Mountain Oysters Once again, we have a delicacy that has a very misleading name. Rocky Mountain Oysters are not found in the sea and are not even from a marine animal. They are, in fact, testicles from either pigs, sheep, bison, or bulls, among other mammals. Most likely originally eaten to avoid wasting precious food, they're now served deep-fried as an appetizer with cocktail dipping sauce. Alternative names include prairie oysters, calf fries, cowboy caviar, and swingin' beef, among others. Number 7. Tong Zidan The second strange food on our list to come out of China is Tong Zidan. The food itself is not what sets it apart, but how it's prepared. The delicacy involves cooking eggs in the urine of boys under 10 years old. Because of this, it's also called virgin boy eggs. Not only does this excretion supposedly imbue the egg with numerous health benefits, such as increasing blood flow and lowering your internal temperature, but apparently makes the dish soak up flavor. It takes an entire day to cook, and the residents of Dongyang keep their vendors busy with orders. Number 6. Tipa You might not be as intrigued to try tipa if you saw it on a menu by its other name, Stinkheads. A traditional delicacy in Alaska, tipa is fermented fish heads. It ensures none of the fish goes to waste and has been eaten by Alaskan residents for many, many years. It can be prepared in a few different ways in different countries, who also call it a variety of names. In Alaska, it is most often fermented in the ground in a fermentation pit, but can also be left in plastic bags or on its own. Number 5. Escamoles Escamoles are a delicacy from Mexico made from the larvae and pupae of ants that have been harvested from the roots of the tequila agave plant. It's considered to be a food for the higher class and has been that way since it was eaten by the Aztecs. Escamoles are often pan-fried with butter and spices, but can be included in more well-known dishes such as tacos and omelets. Tasting slightly like nuts and butter, they can also be eaten on their own. What makes eating these ants all the more amusing is that they are known for their venomous bite and the difficulty it takes in catching them. Number 4. Sanakji This dish comes from Korea and is a small octopus. It can be served two ways, cut up into small pieces while still alive, or as a whole live baby octopus. For the former, it is usually lightly seasoned with sesame and sesame oil. While the seasonings are added for taste, it is the texture that makes it so popular to try. The tentacles of the octopus can still manage to kick as you chew, with its suckers sticking to the inside of your mouth. There is minimal preparation involved, and once the octopus has stopped kicking, you can get the leftover cooked for later. Number 3. Hakarl Hakarl 
Sounds Klingon, but it's actually the national dish of Iceland and is made of Greenland shark, or the sleeper shark, that has gone through a fermentation process and then left to hang dry for four to five months. Its taste is not for everyone, and the smell might not be either, with a reported strong aroma of ammonia. The majority of reviews of the dish are not favorable, but when mixed with Brennivin, Icelandic vodka, the taste and texture come together nicely. You can then see why it has remained so popular with those native to Iceland. Number 2. Coxcombs When you look at a rooster, you think of chicken breast and chicken wing, right? You don't normally think of eating its red crest. Well, coxcomb is a food made from this appendage, and it can also be from a turkey or pheasant. It can be the star ingredient in a dish called La Financiera and is devoured predominantly in Europe. For the most part, it is used to create sauce or as a tasty addition to other foods. And our number one food that you probably haven't tried, Shiokara. Coming out of Japan is a delicacy called Shiokara. It's made from the meat of various aquatic animals in a brown paste, heavily salted and fermented partially in its own viscera. The taste is likened to cured anchovies, but its texture is very different. Its smell is not always pleasant, but the taste differs by animal use. It is available in most Japanese restaurants and supermarkets. Bon Appetit! 